this is a movie about human beings, primarily, uh, and it's about, secondly, and most importantly, it's about forgiveness. It's about what happens when you drop the stone in the water and ripples come from the stone. And imagine this movie being the ripples. In other words, what the movie is saying, this is the effect that a screever has. To many people's surprise, religion is still here. I mean, maybe a hundred years ago, people declared God was dead, and he seems to be very much not dead. Indeed, what's beginning to happen, it seems, is as the, the Western world has become more secularized, the gnawing question in people's minds about, well, is there something other? Is there a divine? Has actually got stronger. I was very struck by the charisma that this person had, and I liked his sense of humanity, and that, that began to work on me, and then I thought, wouldn't it be wonderful to write a story? I'll tell you a story about why that's relevant to you sitting in the cinema, whether you be Spanish or you be American, because what he had to bring, this idea of being able to forgive others, is relevant and important to all of us. I think this will appeal to people right across the spectrum of all ages. Think of young people today, that if you ask young people the question, is there a God, there's an immediate response. Yes or no, but there's an immediate interest and an immediate response. It's a story, it's three stories that happened during a certain period of time, which was the Spanish Civil War and um, he happens to be one of the three. There is a love story that's very, very crucial, and I wanted that element in the story too, not only because that's good movie-making, but because it's a way of entering everybody's experience, because that's, in a way, what leads us through the story to understand why Jose Maria would be relevant to us, even if we're not Christian or even if we're not interested in religion in any way at all. We're all interested in love. When audiences sit in the cinema and watch this movie and watch a man undergoing suffering in a sense because his own family is at, at risk but uses that suffering to augment his love and understanding of human beings not to isolate himself from it and to show that working with human beings is divine and I think it would be a marvellous thing for an audience to sit in the cinema and have that moment when the movie stops when the movie's ended where they feel oh my god in the end I am in a ship amongst friends. We may disagree, but our disagreements do not mean we are different. It makes people feel emotional and makes people feel connected and makes people feel that this is a story they want to go and see and makes people, when they come out of the cinema, want to telephone their friends and say, hey, you've got to go and see this movie, whatever religion you may be.